So what are your thoughts, Megan? Can you believe it? I really can't believe it at all. It's been a long time coming, and it's crazy to me to think that it's tomorrow. It was been a fun ride in its mm -hmm. own way. It was great talking to you guys. Congrats. Thank you. Hey everyone, my name is Megan, and today I'm joined by a special guest, my brother John. As seen on previous videos in the background. <laughs> Tomorrow is actually my iron ring ceremony, and so I brought John, who is a obligated engineer, <laughs> to come and we're going to chat a little bit about iron rings. Since, unfortunately, I'm not allowed to film anything once I'm actually inside of the ceremony, so... I guess you guys are just going to have to wait for that one until you have your own iron ring ceremony. <laughs> Where did you go to school and what did you study? I went to the University of Alberta and I studied mechanical engineering. And what are you up to now? I'm working at Greenlight Innovation, which is a hydrogen fuel cell test equipment manufacturer. <laughs> it's a bit of a mouthful, but it's very cool and we work with a lot of different car companies developing a fuel cell technology. What does it mean to you to have your iron ring? It's kind of cool. <laughs> it's a, a reminder to be responsible with your engineering and the work you do. What's fun about it is uh, you can always spot another engineer from across the room. Point, say, <laughs> Are you obligated as well? When we were in San Francisco, we were talking to some people. Oh, and yeah. They had their ring and we yeah. did a little secret nod. You do the... You do this little, little clack, <laughs> clack, clacker. It's only a Canadian tradition right now. It's a very old Canadian tradition, but no one else really does it. A couple American schools have started to do it and adopt it, but this is the only place that you can get an iron ring. Luckily, John gets to come and he actually gets to do a part. I only know the basics because I obviously haven't done it yet, but when you walk in, you rest the ring on like the top part of your knuckle, and then it's not until after you are sworn in you say your oath or whatever else, and then you have someone who's already has an iron ring slide it down, and so John gets to come and be my my ring bear mm -hmm. and, <laughs> and slide my ring onto my pinky finger. So today is the day. We are all dressed up, and we are about to head down to Queen Elizabeth Theatre for our iron ring ceremony. I honestly can't I cannot believe that today is finally here after four plus years of waiting for it. <laughs> now we're recording for real. Say you did it. Three, two, one. We did it! <laughs> Thank you so much for watching. Bye.